Well, welcome everyone and thank you for your patience. And I know we'll have a few more um, coming in and we are ripping through learning about a lot of information to help improve our programs. Um, for this time, we have a special section that we want to make sure that um, everybody get a chance to hear about. So we were trying to let everyone get in as much as possible as they, as they switch from one session to the other. Um, but I will go ahead and get, get started. This year, um, the center is recognizing an inclusive business with the Inclusive Employer Award. Hopefully you can see it in the background. Yay! <laughs> I hope you can see it from, from behind me. Um, and so with this award, um, it really honors businesses that embrace inclusivity and diversity throughout their company, such as the mission statement, hiring practices, including hiring for the post-secondary comprehensive transition program students and completers, and team cohesiveness. Characteristics include a company where policies and practices support equity in the workplace. Opportunities are provided for our FPCTP employees to develop their skills and advance in the company, where diversity and inclusiveness are embraced and where employees show respect to each other and appreciate the differences everyone brings to the workplace. We thank everyone for submitting nominations. We had quite a few. We had the challenge of deciding on one from among a great selection of employers. With great pleasure, we announced the 2020-21 Inclusive Employer of the Year Award, Unlocking Children's Potential UCP Bales Academy Charter School. I'll give you a chance to do your little emojis, thanking them and congratulating them in our session. I'll tell you a little more. In the nomination, Tammy Johnson, who is part of the University of Central Florida's IES Inclusive Education Services Program stated, over the past four years, UC Bales Academy has hosted nine interns from UCF's Inclusive Education Services Program. Three were employed upon graduation at the academy. One voluntarily moved to another position, taking the skills he gained at UCP Bales with him. Two are still employed with them after four years and have become an integral part of their team. Another student who did her internship at UC Bells, UCP Bells is employed at a similar school in her home area of Merritt Island. Mr. Brown has always been willing to provide positive and constructive feedback. He has always asked for suggestions and offered insight into challenges and awarded and encouraged milestones in intern development. His ability to have frank, conversations and recognized potential have made UCP Bales Academy a stellar partner at our, with our program, for our program. Mr. Roger Brown, who is the principal of the UCP Bales Academy is with us today to accept this award. Mr. Brown, we thank you for being with us. We will arrange a time to present it to you in person at your school. So know that we are coming to your school and we have a physical award, but have this one in the back to show our, our appreciation for your work. Thank you for being an inclusive employer, um, inclusive employer and supporting individuals with intellectual disabilities in the workplace. Would you like to say a few words? Absolutely, thank you for this award. Um, I would like to thank um, Tammy Johnson. She's been great working with her um, collaboratively um, as a charter school co consortium of charter schools that supports children with exceptionalities. We find it very, very rewarding and appropriate to work with um, employees, interns, 
um, that may have exceptionalities and we embrace that um, as everyone should have a place to work um, regardless of their exceptionality or challenges. So um, we embrace it with our students, we embrace it with our employees and we love our partnership with UCF. So again, thank you, Tammy, for your nomination. We appreciate it. And um, we thank you for this award today. This is a, you know, a great milestone. Our teachers are excited. We've shared it with our students as well. So again, thank you so much. And we are honored to accept this award. Uh, thank you again. We look forward to actually presenting the award to you in person, to you and your, your school, and just uh, are proud to have you as one of our trailblazers. And you are the inaugural. You are the first. You are the alpha <laughs> 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 to lead the way and model for our, um, other employers um, to consider and think about the benefits that our students bring. And more importantly, thinking about how you provide those work-based experiences during their, in, during their time in our programs, and then going that extra mile and doing what, what is the right thing to do in employing those who, are, um, who meet your, your, your eligibility for contributing to your team. So thank, thank you so you. much. Absolutely, thank you. Yes, thank you for joining us. Have a great day, everybody. All right, thank you. Wow, that's super fantastic. Yay! Wonderful. That's just evidence of what our, our programs do and the connections they make as they as you guys establish your advisory councils and have your job coaches or job developers do outreach and even just the connections that you have yourselves and using those evidence-based and promising practices to make an inclusive program awesome and meaningful for our students to have independent living opportunities and gain employment to contribute in the way that they want to in our society.